so I guess I'm just gonna be basically detailing what has happened since my last video because although it was really good, it's also become kinda of bad. I don't know I don't know what it's become actually. Pissing me off, bro, making all that fucking racket. Basically, so you know Marley and me, I kept talking texting to Marley. And then I guess it's all part of teenage experience, but I need a big house, but these shits are small as fuck. But I guess it's part of the teenage experience, right? So Basically, bro. I kept talking to her and we ended up just meeting up, bro. I met up with her, like, you know, out of the blue, bro. And yeah. I was in my dad's car and I picked her up and we were just talking in the car, bro. And I was I was hype as fuck that first time. And then we did it again the next day. Right? Yeah, yeah. We was that yesterday? Cause it's Wednesday, Tuesday. Damn, have we been hanging out? We've hanging out for like three days in a row or some shit. I can't remember the second time, bro. All I remember is like yesterday. She was holding we her hands and shit, right? And she put my hand on her thigh, bro. She put my fucking hand on her thigh, bro. I need some space. Yeah, I, I got I got the hand on the thigh action, and that was crazy, bro. Like, does she want to fuck or some shit, bro? It doesn't matter because I'm like cooked. One, I, I'm scared by her age, bro. I swear, I'm I'm so paranoid by her age. And two, today I told her like, I mean, I mean after she put her hand on the thigh, like she was tweaking, bro. Like, she was pissed because apparently, like I don't know, I was bullshitting, right? That nah, she said I took her home too early. She said, um, also that Mexican girl is said she could see me like bro I'm, I'm done with that mexican bro i hate her but yeah she was like i was i left too early um what else did she say she said <laughs> she said i left too early i um was i i, I guess she asked me my phone was Fucked up. I guess I think it was storage or some shit, bro. My phone was fucked up. So I, she, I guess she thought that I blocked her or some shit. So she was tweaking over that. She was already about to crash out, but you know what? Even if she was gonna crash out, I don't think she would even follow me. I just was just obsessed with me or something, bro. And then she said I was taking mad on her spot. And like that was like three things I did to piss her off. And she has been dry ever since, bro. It's been like goddamn. B A T T L E. She was like, you could have really said goodnight. Cause I said, well, I'll talk to you whenever you want to talk. Because she was like, I'll leave you alone for now. She said, shoot, you could at least say goodnight. I mean, we we hung it again today. You know, I hung up for like two hours. I, I did. Oh my god, I was actually touching a girl's thigh. Jesus, I got I got lock in, bruh. I can't lock it actually. But I told her like, you know, I was I got I've been getting scared. Like, she said. We gotta talk like she wants me to protect over her. I told her, like, yo, you looking for anything serious or anything? Because I'm not. She said she wasn't, but I don't know. She acting like she has been. But we're gonna see where this goes. I mean, she still texted me. We still hung out. I still put my hand on her thigh. I was still rock hard, you know? But she's been real dry since, like, I'm on delivery. I, I, it's because I, I dry texted too, but I'm just on delivery for like a while now, bro. I mean, I'm chilling though, of course. And I'm always chilling. It's just weird, though. But, um... I can really make this. That's crazy. Ah! Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna see where this goes, I guess. I mean, I really wanna fuck her. I don't know if she'll let me fuck or anything. I'm getting, like, out of energy for all this shit, though. I'm not gonna lie. I mean, I guess we'll just see what happens. Um, yeah, so I'm so glad that spring break is next week. I'm hoping things can really just keep going well with her. Because I, it's like, I enjoy her company, like, doing that touchy-touchy shit with her. But I just don't want a relationship, bro. So, I guess I'll just see how she is tomorrow. I don't even know if I should say goodnight tonight. Cause I'm really tired. I'm gonna go to sleep at, like, after this video. I might watch like a little bit of Sons of Anarchy, but it's already pretty late. I do want to get a lot of sleep in, but 
hope it, I also post it. You know, I also post it. <coughs> I hope it's not the end, though. That's all I'm hoping. Well, I mean, I wouldn't mind if it was the end. That's just why I never always... This is why I always prevent myself from getting too attached, bro. Because shit can end in a heartbeat. You feel me? Save these cores, Makai. Save these cores. I mean, I'm just gonna go all out. But shit can always end in a fucking heartbeat, bruh. So. I mean, I'm, I'm just chilling for now. I'm trying to think of other, anything else that's happening. I mean, nah, because Marley's really been consuming my life, so other shit I would talk about, like, I, I mean, of course shit has happened, but it's just I, like, not put any fucking, like, you know, thought into it happening. I've just been, it's, been, it's just been Marley, 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 because, like, I mean, rightfully so, because, like, the, I'm touching the bitch's thigh and shit, like, that's, that's press, that's talk worthy right there. You know? I have been, like, actually, like, I don't know why. I've been dogging the charger lately, bro. I've actually been dogging the fuck out of it, bro. I gotta chill out. I'm gonna put that little 2.7 the rest of the way I'm going, bro. I don't know why I've been dogging it either. I've just have been. The Honda is almost due for an oil change. That's why I don't feel like driving it. But at the same time, I can't keep driving the charger, bro. Well, I mean, as long as I'm talking to Marley, I will. Once she, once, once that ship has sailed, I will definitely stop driving the charger. I'll give you a much needed, needed break. Iron. I'm really trying to think of more shit because I don't want to keep playing Minecraft, but. At the same time, it's just for a video, you know, I'm not going to keep playing this shit after I get out, or at least I don't want to. Yeah, she still has not responded either, so I guess I'm just going to chill. I really don't want to stomp mobs right now, I would die. I'm trying to keep playing this road, honestly, bro. I'm gonna see where life takes me, I guess. I'm actually, I'm actually so sick though, cause I don't know. Like, Marley's a good girl, I feel, but I really do feel like she's a good girl. I wonder if I'm gonna regret just not doing anything with her. I really wonder if I'm gonna regret it. I'm mostly like fighting. I'm holding back tears, imagining. Myself regretting it, bro. I'm actually holding back tears right now because I would never find. I feel like I'll never find a girl like her again. Well, I'm actually kind of scared she's a freshman. That's my why she's asking like this. I mean, she's a sophomore. I guess they could act like that too. But if she's a freshman, bro, I'm gonna kill myself. I swear, cause like her username had like 09 or something in it, and it just it's throwing me off, bro. Cause that would mean she was born in 2009. She was born in 2009. She, she, she turned 15 this year, bro. And I'm 18. I don't give a damn. Cause even then, I'm like, I, I'd be 30 and she's 27. Like, three years is actually a noticeable gap, bro. I'm not even gonna lie, bro. Three years is a noticeable gap. Like, you know how niggas probably be like, hey, my, how far apart are your parents? Nah, bro. Three years is still a noticeable ass gap, bro. That doesn't become, like, irrelevant to, like, your 30s, bro. I was like your 40s. That's that's starts becoming irrelevant in my opinion. But anyways, yeah, I just hope I don't regret anything, bro. <laughs> and it's high Asia, bro. She crashed out over me, bro. Like, okay, bitch. That's nice. I guess I'm 
I'm just gonna go home and, you know, and then, uh, you know? I guess I've said all I need to say, really. Yeah, we gotta get home. Nigga, it's getting dark. It was 3.51. I wasn't even that far for real, bro. The keepers are already out. That shit is crazy. I don't even know which house is mine. Yeah, she's slaying responding, bro. I said, okay, bad. I mean, that's cool, you know? It's just like, she's trying to talk about good night and shit. I'm not gonna double text that shit. Where am I? I have some self-respect, nigga. Alright, this is concludes this video.